Now we shall discuss about the agro based industries in that we have the sugar industry. In that sugar industry, in India has a significant place when it comes to the production of sugar. India is standing at second place in the production of sugar. This we need to remember very carefully because India is having many resources. In that sugar plays a very very important role. India stands second place in the production of sugar means the first country which stands in production of sugar at the top level is Cuba, a very small country located in the northern American continent. Now moving on to understand that which place is actually India is having the production of sugar. Gur and Kansari are the two famous points where we have the sugar production in a very very large scale in the northern belt. But as we move on to understand now the scenario of establishing a sugar cane industry or a sugar cane industry has been started to move towards to other regions especially they started to shift towards southern and western states what is the reasons that made the people especially the establishers of sugar industry to migrate from the northern states towards the southern and the western states those are the first point what we need to understand is that the high sucrose content the sucrose content is available in a very very high range so it is very difficult to transport this high sucrose content at very short distance the problem is when a sugar cane is having a high sucrose content it has to be transported very soon to the nearest mill where a sugar mill has to be established and the factory has to be there to not to do the processing done then only the sucrose content can be reduced if not we cannot achieve that one but when it comes to here when there is a high sucrose content and the transportation delay is there that will automatically result in the loss of the sucrose content that is the main reason why we need to have high sucrose content the next one is cool climate in the west and the southern india you may get a doubt how we, india is getting cool and uh, Uh, less climatic temperatures when it compares to north though it is very close to himalayas when we look at the geographical location of india the geographical location of india clearly shows for us that when we move on to the south it is having a peninsular location where it has three sides water and also having western ghats and eastern ghats which makes them to receive heavy rainfalls when we receive heavy rainfalls automatically it results in the establishment of heavy Uh, cool and pleasant temperatures that is the reason why we have cool temperature which also results in the longer crushing climatic condition where we can crush the sugar cane for a longer time that is an added advantage when we have the cool climate and what are the challenges that the sugar cane industry is facing the sugar cane industry is facing the seasonal nature attitude of the crop a crop will be getting only in the time of when we have the rains and in the winter season in summer sugar cane crop cannot be grown so in summer it is absent that is having the seasonal nature of the crop the second one is the methods what they are following are old and inefficient now moving on to understand what are the other problems that we face when it comes to get the problems or challenges when it comes to sugar cane industry that is old and the inefficient methods what they are following actually and then the transport delay as i told you before when the sucrose content is transported for long distances the quantity of the sucrose which is present in the sugar cane gets decayed when it travels for long distance so when you observe the sugar cane if you buy a sugar cane in the morning and evening if you look at that the edges of the sugar cane started to come closer and starts to come closer towards itself releasing that the sucrose content is coming down that naturally we can understand when you look at the sugar cane so when the bulk of the sugar cane is transported for long distances that will automatically result in lessening the content of the sucrose so transportation delay is another major problem that is the reason why they are moving from the other regions to this side and to they also need to upgrade their system by using maximum usage of the baggage system this baggage is also are very very important issues these are the major challenges what they are facing when it comes to the sugar cane industry and why it is not so developed in the northern regions and why the people are moving towards the southern and the western states first of all we are standing in the second place in the production of the sugar cane but as the time passed on and as situations are changing now the gur and the kansari regions and all the other regions 
we are facing a difficult problems because uh, the people started to migrate from that region to this region when i talk about the people the people those who are actually want to cultivate sugar and those who are actually running the sugarcane industries those people those who are manufacturing the sugar these people started to change their mindset and started to move towards the southern and the western states and this major advantages while moving from this uh, north to the south and the western states are the high sucrose content will automatically be added advantage because of the good climatic condition heavy rains wet moisture climate hot and humid climatic conditions and also moderate temperature climate these all are the added advantage of this one and then the long crushing climate we also get the advantages of a long crushing climate from june till december or till jan we can do the crushing of the cane so that would be an added advantage for the crop and the challenges what they are facing are the seasonal nature the old and the inefficient system what they are following now and the transportation delay as i told you the seasonal nature of the crop is a major disadvantage because in summer you don't have any work in the industry because the crop cannot be produced while the transportation will play a major role in getting the maximum output from the crop once if the crop has been done with the work and you do the harvesting after the harvesting is done obviously we have to move on in search of a transport system because you need to transport it immediately to the nearest factory where the processing can start then only you get the maximum output of the sucrose what is present in the sugar field the cane otherwise you would lose the content of the sucrose and it results in the half of the delay definitely it would result in the more than half of the loss of the sucrose content of the crop so this is a major disadvantage and now it's a very high time to maximize the usage of bagages all these things are the important factors which we need to remember when it come to the consideration of the sugar industry if you like this video please give a thumbs up please subscribe to our channel to get more videos on cbse syllabus